I just wanted to say for the purposes of our audience, um, Eric did not really mean get off the internet. What he meant was get off the internet when you're done watching this interview. Yes. Okay. Exactly. <laughs> yes. I mean, have a life. I honestly, I've noticed this, and, and the most interesting thing about it is even the political discussions I have with people. And, and I don't mean to be insulting to anyone. And some people may say it about me; they'd be surprised by my level of extra internet activities. But the the people I come into contact with in politics, who tend to be the most maladjusted, malcontented souls, their life revolves around a singular issue, whether it's the internet or whether it's you. you Pick your thing. Uh, we're supposed to be diverse creatures. We're, we're supposed to be creatures within a creation and, and be able to, to embrace creation and, and the wonders that God has provided. And I think people become so narrow minded and narrow focused when there's turbulence within that focus, they become embittered. And there's so much out there. I, and my wife and I went on date night Saturday, saw a great movie, and I came home. I made curry. I taught a cooking school last week. I played with the kids. There's a lot to love about the world, just not a lot on the shrillness of the internet.